and that would give me a challenge against stimulating experience para mas marami pa ba akong um, acquire na knowledge and to discover more about myself than my capabilities and weaknesses. Pag narinig ko yung UNB, parang naisip agad ng mga tao na maganda yung na-produce ng interns, parang maganda kasi yung training nila. So, ayun, gusto ko naman ma-train sa Java and know yung UNB. blockmates ko, marinig pala nila na hindi intern ka ng ONB, ganyan. I mean, kasi alam nila, ONB is really mahirap talagang makapasok, ganyan. Second is yung, since plan ko rin mag-software engineering after I graduate. So, from this internship, sarang na-excited na ako na matututo on how software engineering works and yung mga ginagamit nila na tools on how they collaborate with each other. Kaya sobrang doon ako na-excited dun sa internship. so many things that are not even taught at school. I even learned that school programming is far and way different than real-world programming because requirements are always subject to change. I'm very thankful and glad that I underwent those two weeks of training before I was even deployed to the existing project because it helped me a lot. It helped me to adapt to the framework that OMB is using and it also helped me prepare for what is in store for that project. I like the real-world examples from my mentors because I learned that it's not just important to know how things work and why they should be done and what are its implications. And I really appreciated uh, the people's very warm uh, na sa aming interns and Everyone was very approachable and nice. So far, in sa internship experience, it's really vigorous nga talaga ang training. Lalo na dun sa first two weeks, din sobrang nagisa talaga dun sa skills ko. So, parang naisip ko, ah, ang ganito naman coding. Pero nung when I did yung trainings, yung mga OJT, sabi ko para ayan, tanga-tanga ko pala sa coding, dami ko pala ang pagkukulang. Siguro yung pinakamaganda na natutunan ko is yung practices tapos yung, yung, yung best practices sa, ano, sa work environment, sa coding practice. Yeah. In my training, I remember Sir Callen saying that when you're stuck with a problem, do the simplest thing that could possibly work. And I also learned the value of concern to your fellow programmers that you have to write clean and readable code. Kailangan may discipline ka to keep on learning and may perseverance ka rin and to never stop learning talaga. Challenging but fun. <laughs>